What up, y'all? Welcome to Valencia, Spain. I just got back from the Alba Berlin Valencia game, man. Feel like doing things a little different, so we're gonna start with the ending. Then I'm gonna show y'all what I did for the rest of the day. So yeah, things gonna be a little backwards today, but this is how we gonna kick it off. This wasn't my first time at Valencia's arena. I wasn't expecting a Serbian type atmosphere, but I know Valencia got good fans in regards to Spanish fans in the atmosphere. Valencia has an older arena, but I kind of like it. They're actually gonna get a new arena in a few years, but I kind of like this one. As for the game, the first half was tight, but the last three minutes is where things got interesting.
In the end, Valencia ended up winning and I stayed after for a little bit. I hollered at Chris Jones and uh, Gabriele Prochita. And uh, yeah, now I'm back at the hotel. But earlier, I took a nice little walk to the uh, city center. At least I think it's the city center. It's this plaza that has like everything, man. And like the walk itself was cool. It was a little windy. Uh, I don't know what was going on today. The, the weather said it was gonna be 80 degrees, but it was a little windy. Once I got to the center, one thing I noticed is Valencia reminds me a lot of Madrid. And I think now that I've lived in Madrid for a while now, like it, it, I can see the, I can see the comparison a little more clearly. And uh, I think it's a perfect mix of Madrid and Barcelona almost into one city, man. It's, it's super beautiful. I really love Valencia. Um, of course, they had a five guys. They had a five guys in the plaza and like, I feel like every city and country I go to now got a five guys. And it's cool, don't get me wrong, but I'm from California. We got five guys, but we got in and out And our whole in and out is like the number one. It's kind of like a little rivalry between five guys and in and out But uh, unfortunately, in and out is just, it's not even available everywhere in the States, let alone in Europe. But, but in a nutshell, that was pretty much my day. But right now it's time to eat because all I had today was a salad because I arrived to Valencia at four o'clock. And you know, if you arrive at four o'clock in any city in Spain, the kitchen is closed until 8 p.m. So from four to eight, you ain't getting no kind of food. So all they could make me was a salad earlier. So it's dinner time. I appreciate y'all tuning in. Um, I'm back on the road tomorrow. Now, actually, I'm back to Madrid tomorrow, but I'll be on the road uh, this weekend or early next week. And uh, yeah, let's stay tuned and, and see where I end up next.